This is an unbiased review on the Maximum Advantage Grip, better known as Mag Grip. This is the Close Grip Supinated version. They have seven different variants of this in different shapes and sizes. And you buy one, you want another one, and then you get used to that one, you want another one. And <laughs> there's a lot of friends that I have at the gym where like I have two of them and two other people have different variants. And so we're like trading off and like, okay, I'll let you borrow mine for a while and then and, and I'll and I'll take yours. So uh, there's a couple things I like about it and there's something I don't like about it. Um, I'll jump right into it. So what's what this is designed for is to take your forearms and your biceps out of the equation. So that's why I started with this one. If you're going to start with any of them, I would recommend starting with this one. Um, because when you do a seated cable row and if you want to work your lower lats or if you're doing a lat pull down, both of those exercises with a supinated grip, which is your hands face like this, are very effective at targeting the lower lats. However, when you supinate your wrist, your biceps want to jump in and that takes work away from your lats. And so it really makes it hard to hit your your lats when you do those exercises. Now, if you want to grow your biceps, there's better ways to go about doing that. So you can do some curls, you can do some isolation work. Uh, but if you really want to build your back, in particular your lats, this thing has really helped me out a lot. Um, it has a very nice grip on it. It's coated with, I guess, rubber or something, but whatever it does, uh, you don't need to use chalk. Uh, this is way better than what most gyms have, which is just like a straight bar. Cause then you have to grab it and, and you have to grip it hard. And then that engages all these muscles that you're really not trying to work. So having something like this, your thumbs are on the same side as your fingers and the grip is just solid. And the mind muscle connection to your back is so much easier with one of these. So that's pretty much everything I love about it. Oh, they don't come with carabiners. You can get them on their on their website, which is uh, maxagrip.com. I'll put a link to that, but it doesn't come with a carabiner. And the reason that I, that I have this is because a lot of gyms have um, hoist cable setups which are great it's a very very good brand but it's not compatible with this little um, eye hole here so uh, if you're going to get one of these <clears throat> what i'd recommend is going to um, home depot and getting a 3 8 inch carabiner it's just like five or six bucks and then you'll be able to use it on whatever piece of equipment that you want so that is everything that i love about it. the only thing that i don't like about it is actually nothing to do with the product i just wish these guys were more on their social media you know um, whenever I, whenever I join a gym, whenever I, um, buy something like, like the Bandville Rhino Flex bar, um, I like to be part of the community. I like to feel like I'm part of the people that, um, that, that run the company. And so with Bandville, um, Jim's an awesome guy. And so I experienced that, but with these guys, it's like impossible to get their attention. So I'm sure they're great guys, but, um, anyway, I've only tried my Instagram. So that's pretty much it. Um, love this thing. And, uh, no matter, no matter no matter if you're a competitor or if you're somebody that's just starting out i think that even if you are just starting out i think this would be a great tool to have it's uh it's a toy it's fun um it's not something to where you need to be a super advanced lifter to be able to use one of these so yeah if you decide to get one of these let me know what your thoughts are what your experience is i'd be curious to hear what it is